It was a night of celebration for the Copper Queen's maiden World Cup appearance. Government has hosted the Copper Queens for a dinner to honor them for participating at the 2023 Women World Cup. Sports Minister Elvis Nkando represented President Haga in the Hijilema at the dinner. The 2023 FIFA Women's World Cup tournament was a very good experience for our Copper Queens. And I believe we shall only grow stronger from this experience. As such, I implore the Football Association of Zambia to continue exposing our Copper Queens to more quality international friendly matches. As this is the only way our team will gain the much required exposure, thus building their confidence. And Football Association of Zambia President Andrew Kamanga thanked government for the support rendered to the team before and during the tournament. We wish to congratulate government through the Ministry of Sport and Arts for introducing equal pay for both men's and women's teams representing Zambia in Africa Cup and World Cup competitions. This is commendable and will go a long way in motivating particularly the Copper Queens. For the Copper Queens, it is time to reflect on their early exit from the tournament and work hard for future international tournaments. Let me take this opportunity to thank the government for the support and the prayers made, which we hope to receive soon. Let me end by thanking the coaches for the hard work, the Football Association of Zambia, for the excellent preparation before, during, and after the World Cup, the government for the support, and the team for the effort, and the fans for the support. The Copper Queens may have been eliminated from the ongoing Women World Cup, but their maiden appearance at the World Soccer Showpiece is an achievement worth celebrating. Prince Gioni, ZNBC News, Lusaka.